I'm gonna do here, this is called my Prospective Bidder Reference Form. And basically what this is, it tells a little bit about me and my experience, again, for the last uh, 11 years doing this business. So um, basically I have my name, my company name, um, I give a couple of references, people that I've done business with, okay, so the bank can go back in and check my reference. Um, I have some past banks that I've dealt with. I've got my foreclosure company that I used also. They're, they're one of my references. Also, I've got my attorney here, okay? And then on this page right here, I'm gonna show you a little bit later. Basically, I have my uh, company's past history that I'm working with. The funder that has the money, the 50 million and the 25 million, I have their history of how much they've bought, okay, over the last three years. Now, one of these companies, they bought $44 million, you guys, within the last three years. They bought $44 million of performing paper, non-performing paper, and REOs, okay, and that's real powerful that I give to the banks. And the last thing on the page is how much they're expecting to spend, okay, for 2010. Now, in the second quarter, they expect to spend 15 to 30 million Okay, on these non-performing notes and performing notes and REOs. Third quarter, they're gonna spend 20 to 30 million. And now in fourth quarter, 30 to 55 million dollars, you guys. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna give this to the bank, okay, as I go in and talk to the special assets department. Again, this is what the form looks like, okay? This talks about the history of the company and what they spent. Basically their history of operations and their purchasing schedule. Okay, and it's called a company profile. Then what I'm gonna show is proof of funds, you guys. Man, I got proof of funds here, right here, okay? $1.6 million that's in a bank account. This one right here, you guys, $10 million, okay? That's sitting, again, in a bank account for proof of funds to buy, again, these distressed assets from the bank. And then one last one, 3.5 million, you guys. So that's my proof of funds letter that I have that I'm taking into the bank so that they can put me on their list so I can buy their portfolios or loans. Hey guys, last, what I'm gonna do is when I get home, I'm gonna shoot them an email just reminding them what I came into the bank to do today, okay? It tells a little bit about me, my company, what I'm doing as a buyer's representative for this funder, okay? And it just reminds them, again, of why I came in today so they don't forget me. Guys, you can also take this email and you can just send it by itself to the bank. Okay, and my student Darius, I'm telling you, he's killing it. He's knocking it out of the park, you guys. He's sending this email and he's getting banks to call him back. Okay, and they're sending him portfolios with, along with the ND NC forms.